hello everyone welcome back to our another tutorial so today we will learn how to edit our checkout fields uh, using our plugin if, uh, totally fully free so here's our uh, defa by default our feeds so how we can edit remove add new feeds so easily without any code so go back to our uh, admin dashboard add a new plugin so here's our type plugin check out oh sorry check out so here's uh, the first uh, plugins of uh, theme high uh, check out field editor check out manager for woocamera so simply install that plugin Once the install uh, plugin, you just activate that plugin, and now we can do the magic with our checkout field fields. So go back to our uh, checkout field editor. So our plugin successfully installed. Go to plugin setting by here. Are using here checkout form. So go to checkout form. So you can see here's all the fields, all possible fields uh, by default is activated, required. If you remove any fields, uh, let's suppose we just need a full name, not a first and last name. So we just click here, remove this field, simply remove. So we added, a we need a full name. So just here type a full name so uh, f first uh, farm row first class simple farm row so required enable and save and close save and close one second so here's our full name so because we just uh, disable right from save as go here last time we have not saved our fields so you can see here's uh, become a full name if you uh, disable or remove this uh, i'm highly recommending you just disable the fields because if the remove is not, uh, not uh, undoable so i just recommended you just disable the fields and save changes so the uh, uh, company is removed because we first select the remove field so it is not uh, uh, returnable so i will highly recommend you just uh, do the uh, disable field so reload them you can see the country a uh, company is uh, hired you can also if you make a two row feeds uh, let's suppose we making a country and uh, these two town city and state make a two row so we just uh, last in a we need copy this one class is a default class we can make it city so here's a here's a white so just copy first and save and close go back to here and reload where is where state let me check once again farm first row yes I what's class farm first oh yes let me one sec again uh, it's showing an errors let me go to city save and close so your changes not have or not be due to errors you have made none so we reset to our default feeds so go back to our default feed so you can see here's our company also return now we are on our default mode so check here the farm first row class if go back to farm second is the farm or last so also copy the first and last row so go to our this field state you can see here's a class is a farm row wide address field so just we can add here from for row first save and close yes save changes 
we make it city now we load uh, is still some issue with city or state let me check now we can see here our fields classes okay this is a wide class uh, address it's not a uh, getting our uh, farm row farm row first so it's a uh, getting our class also so something is uh, missing in that area so let's figure out go back to here and uh, let's do another phone number right make it first save close here's reload yes a phone uh, the issue with uh, address fields you can see here's our phone is a uh, small so we can make it email also so just go to here and type a last save and close just reload this in this one yeah you can see here's our default uh, make a two rows so you can easily if you want to add a new field you just click uh, add new type of the field uh, let's suppose you can choose a number uh, billing phone number already mobile number already so we just add uh, something else uh, order custom number if you need to a uh, custom number of order so just add like this billing order number order number so if you want to add a place holder so you can add higher farm uh, we need a first small so just save and close you can set a display in the order and everything so just re reload this screen you can see here is order number of fields is also come here so uh, finally we have today learn how to set up our uh, checkout fields by using checkout field editors this is a very simple and basic uh, steps so finally we are creating this one if you like our video please thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel thank you very much